Okay, students. Um, in order for us to move forward, we need to just go backward a little bit and make sure we do all simple shapes area. So you're gonna make some notes, and whatever the date is, you put your date on it. I'm making these notes on Friday, third. So whatever date you take the notes, make sure you make some notes. So we're going to review area. And the first uh, shape we're going to review is a rectangle. So draw you a neat rectangle. And here we have our length. And I'll call that L. And our width. I'll call that W. Our area of this rectangle is equal to the length times the width. Right? Our next common shape is a triangle. Now the triangle, you have the height and you have the base. The area of the triangle is one half the base times the height. And so when we see the base, we have base here and H for height. So that's your letters there. The next shape we have is a trapezoid. The trapezoid has two bases that are parallel to each other. I'm going to call this base 2. So that's going to be B2. And this is going to be base 1. We're going to call that B1. And then we have the height of the trapezoid. And we'll use H for that. So the area of a trapezoid is one half the sum of B1 plus B2 times the height. So all of that's being multiplied by each other. If you have letters and numbers right next to each other, it automatically is that they're being multiplied. This quantity in parentheses, you add it first, then you want to multiply it. So, <clears throat> these are some basic shapes. The last shape, circle. The area of a circle, we have a diameter. And so, well, that's the radius, which is half the diameter. So, the area of a circle is equal to pi times the radius squared. So the radius is represented by the letter R. Uh, these are your basic shapes. And the reason why I'm reviewing this is because so you can have it in your notes. We're going to go to the subject of composite area and we're going to go back to surface area. So this is our subject composite area that we're going to be talking about and apply this positive area.